The Florida Department of Transportation contracted with the Miami Access Tunnel to construct two 42-foot outside diameter tunnels two foot outside diameter tunnels with two lanes of traffic each islands to alleviate traffic congestion in downtown Miami. Malcolm Drilling Company Incorporated is the specialty foundation contractor constructing the two sets of supportive excavation, break-in and breakout plugs, and soil improvement for the launch and reception of the tunnel boring machine. The geological profile on Watson and Dodge Islands presented a formidable challenge. Fill material with rubble overlies the native sand. Underneath the native sand are several layers of porous, buggy limestone of inconsistent strengths. Loss of material into the highly voided lower limestone layers was a primary concern prior to the start of the project. Malcolm Drilling was challenged with the various foundation elements on the Port of Miami Tunnel which includes a 48-inch continuous flight auger pre-drilled through soil and rock for preparation of the subsurface material for the cutter soil mixing. Malcolm Drilling's work on the Port of Miami Tunnel highlights the versatility of the Bauer BG and Klim drill rigs. The Bauer BG-50, the first of its kind in the world, is being used to perform pre-drilling of the overlying soil and limestone to a depth of over 65 feet, or 20 meters. A Bauer BG-40 installed 36-inch diameter Type II tension elements, which are drilled shafts made highly challenging by reinforcement and concrete cutoffs from 15 to 25 feet below grade. Temporary 48-inch casing was initially installed and excavated below concrete cutoff to provide support of excavation during the removal of excess concrete. A 39-inch sectional casing was installed inside the 48 inch casing to the tip of the tension element. Malcolm Drilling has completed over 800 linear feet or 244 meters of supportive excavation wall. Daily wet bulk samples of the cutter soil mixing material and subsequent cores from the verification borings confirmed the minimum strength requirement of 250 PSI. Malcolm Drilling is scheduled to start work on Dodge Island in the support of excavation in May 2011.